What's up, Centennial? This is your favorite host, Cami G. And David G. And welcome, parents, to Curriculum Night. Here we have a message from Dr. Blackwell. Centennial United families, I want to welcome you to Curriculum Night. My name is Dr. Opie Blackwell, and I am the proud new principal here at Centennial High School. And I want to thank you in advance for welcoming into this evening, uh, getting to know our teachers and creating better relationships. One thing I want you to know out of three things I have to share with you this evening is uh, about relationships, as a matter of fact. One of the things that is central to who I am and that we are asking all the staff members to focus on this year at Centennial is just that, building relationships with your students, your prized possessions, and the kids who you give us the opportunity to work with day in and day out. Uh, that may look like doing get-to-know-you games in the beginning of the year. That might look like sidebar conversations that our teachers are having with your kids day in and day out. But it is a priority here at Centennial in this united community that we give our students the opportunity to have great relationships, not only with the staff members, but also with their fellow peers. So I hope you'll join in that effort. That's part of the reason that we do tonight, so that you can have relationships with us and we with you. The second thing that I want you to know about this school year, one of my personal philosophies is that I want your high school students here at Centennial to be smart, to be happy, and to be connected. And so to me, that means that we work this year together to provide them a great learning environment that's going to nurture and challenge them. We provide them a space where they get to become connected with a small niche group of students who might be like-minded or could be very different and then they, they get to explore their passions while they're here at Centennial and get to learn a lot during the course of that. And the third thing that I want to share with you tonight is how you can be involved as parents. You know, we're oftentimes asked, what can we do to support the school? And the easiest thing, the most helpful thing that you can do, if nothing else, is to stay connected with your child by checking Infinite Campus and making sure that you're aware of what they're doing and where they may need help by developing routines and helping ensure that your kids stay with those routines to focus on their schoolwork amidst all of their extracurricular activities and by of course engaging with our staff and that again is the point of this evening so I hope you get to enjoy meeting the teachers and staff members who love being here at Centennial working with your kids day in and day out and if ever you need it as a parent, we are also here to support you. So at this time, I would love to introduce you to the rest of the Centennial Administrative Team and welcome you once again to Curriculum Night. Hi, my name is Gail Ritchie. I'm one of the assistant principals here at Centennial. I am over the Science, Fine Arts, and Health and PE department, as well as over students with the last names KN through RI. Hi, my name is Tiffany Crumpton and I am one of the assistant principals here at Centennial High School. I am over the special education department and the CTAE department. I am also responsible for students last names D-O through K-N. Hi, my name is Antonio Grant and I'm one of the assistant principals here at Centennial High School. I lead the ELA, World Language, and ESL departments. I'm also responsible for students who have the last name A, through DN. Hi, I'm Logan Gilbo, one of the assistant principals here at Centennial High School. I supervise the math and social studies departments, and I'm also responsible for students with the last names of letters RJ to Z. Hi, I'm Stephanie Pete. I'm an instructional coach, go tip advisor, and AP testing coordinator. Hi, I'm Jenna Silverman, and I am the 504 and RTI coordinator, and I'm also the student success skills school champion. Well, hello and welcome. My name is Andrea von Beverstein, and I coordinate the IB diploma program. Good evening. My name is Trey Henson. I'm the athletic director here at Centennial High School. Please come out and join us at as many athletic events as you can. Season passes are available on GoFam. Go Knights! Hi, my name is Brandon McIntosh, and I'm one of your assistant administrators here at Centennial High School. Uh, many of my roles and duties include 
uh, the coordinator over a, uh, PSAT and ACT, as well as dealing with some transportation, such as your bu uh, your students' buses that they will be riding in the mornings and afternoons. Um, I'm also the assistant athletic director, so I support Coach Henson. And I also deal with tardies and attendance, so to make sure that your students are getting to school on time, getting, getting to their classes on time. So that's, uh, if you hear from me, hopefully, you know, that means that we got to straighten out some things with your students to, uh, to get them to school and also to make sure that they're attending all their classes. Go Knights! Please take a moment to scan this QR code to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hello Knights, I am Marcy Saunders with your local PTSA. Uh, we are the Parent Teacher Student Association and we are here to support the school's efforts in making the education here for our students the best it can be. We partner with our amazing administration, the phenomenal teachers and the parents and ultimately all of the students to make Centennial the best place to learn, grow and succeed. Hi, my name is Mac Hennessy uh, and from the PTSA mini grant program, I've gotten a few things over the years. The first is this whiteboard I got last year. Uh, one of the problems in AP World History is that we're constantly jumping from time and place. So I've been able to make this nice long timeline on here that I think will help students see when certain civilizations are around, uh, where they're located, and kind of help see the connections between them. Additionally, I've gotten all of my country flags from the mini grant program, which has been awesome because it provides a little color to the classroom. Students will often guess which each flag is. Uh, and I can also connect it to my curriculum. For example, we'll talk about how the Indian flag, the spinning wheel on it, was a major symbol of their independence movement back in the 50s. Uh, so the mini grant program has been awesome. The PTSA has done great things for Centennial. And so I highly encourage everyone, please join, please be a part. Thank you, go Knights. Wondering why you should join the PTSA? We do so many things here at Centennial for our parents, our teachers, our students, and the entire staff here at Centennial. Should you join? Absolutely. What if you're a student? Should you join? You absolutely should join as a student because during your senior year, for a $10 membership, you have the opportunity to apply for a scholarship up to $1,000. Hi, I'm John Riggins. I'm a teacher here at Centennial High School. I teach visual arts. And over the years, the PTSA has done many grant programs and we have benefited through that by having ceramic glazes and special lights for photos. So please support the PTSA by joining today. So why should you join the PTSA? What do we do with your donations? We support the entire school in many ways. We also allow the opportunity for teachers to apply for mini grants for things like art supplies, calculators, the JROTC ball, metronomes, field trips, science lab materials, all sorts of things that we do to support all of the different activities here at Centennial. One of my favorite things that we do though is we provide Wellness Wednesdays for our students. We provide activities, food, um, things to help them get through some of the tough things that all these students have to navigate through. Sometimes we'll do yoga, we'll bring in puppies and allow them to pet them during lunch. Um, we bring snacks in sometimes maybe for Halloween or Valentine's Day. We'll do anything we can to help support the physical and emotional well-being of our students. They are the reason why we're here. And here's a QR code for you to join tonight. Please click on this and head to our website and join at any level. We appreciate all of our members. Another question we get asked a lot is, how can I volunteer? After all, the kids love to see us get involved. 
Click here on this QR code to join our volunteer list and someone from our team will contact you with the opportunities. After all, many hands make light work for all and we couldn't do what we do without all of our amazing volunteers. We are always looking for business partners to help support all of our efforts and programs here at Centennial. If you have a business or know someone who does, please reach out to us at info at ptsa.org. We gladly accept in-kind donations as well as monetary support. Show your true spirit by purchasing some of our spirit wear tonight. We have our tables set up right here in front of this wall and we take Apple Pay, Android Pay, cash, check, and all credit cards. Spiritware is always on sale 24 hours a day at centptsa.org. Thank you, parents, for coming out tonight. And have a great week.